God, I'm just crying out to my young people to put the guns down. A mother who had one son killed and another shot in Arkansas County pleads for the gun violence to stop in the Jefferson County city that she now calls home. This week, Pine Bluff police have investigated multiple shootings. KRK Force Price McKeon joins us live in the studio after talking with this mother for the first time. So connect the dots for us, Price. So, Ashley, a case doesn't connect the two counties or the two cities. It's a mother's pain that moves with her wherever she goes that connects them. The Arkansan moved to Pine Bluff from Stuttgart last year after getting married, and the mom shares her story to try to help stop the violence in her new city. We want to warn you, some people may consider a photo in this story graphic. This is just a memory. It's not what you want. This blanket, pictures around her home. Feed him through these little tubes. And medical supplies by this mother's Pine Bluff yes. front door. Show why the town's many shootings in the week leading up to Mother's Day have Stephanie Bowie, who goes by Anne, praying and pleading for people to put their guns away. I would be right to say that even though you are alive, your mother would be feeling the same pain that I'm feeling because you don't have those hugs anymore. Three months ago, her youngest son was shot and killed in their hometown of Stuttgart, days after his 20th birthday. When it comes to the pain that a mother feels, it is, I can't even describe it. The week before, her 24-year-old son was shot and left for dead in the same town. I wonder, you know, what I did wrong. You know, I, I find myself beating myself up to see where I could have done better. This mother shares her pain on TV for the first time. So people thinking of pulling a trigger might think twice and stop, even if it's only to protect their mothers from this. It's just ongoing, you know, like, because the memories are there. The memories are there, you know. I, I find myself sometimes just smelling his cologne, you know, because it just, it's just a reminder of him. There had a lot more to say to her community and a lot more of her story, story to share. We're working on posting her full emotional and passionate interview for you on our website. Just go to kark.com.